Hello, welcome to my channel. In this video, we will cover something which is very interesting in JavaScript, which is comparison of different types. Here I listed two. Do you know the answer for them? Okay, so now let's take a look at uh, today's video. Uh, today's content. Okay, this video is content. Comparison. We will cover uh, several, okay? Uh, it's easier for the first case, which is a boolean. Uh, when we do compare, boolean is a result. Okay, it's a, boolean means true or false. So here we all compare with the numbers, right? So we have two greater than one. Okay, it's true. Okay, two equals equals one and false. Two not equals to one. It's gonna give it true. Okay. Next one is uh, string comparison. So if we want to see whether a string is greater than another, JavaScript will use the so-called dictionary or lexicographical order. In other words, string are compared letter by letter. The other one is if you have special character, it will using ASCII order. Okay. So here we have a Z uh, greater than A. It will give you true. Let's take a look at uh, through uh, code. Let's go. Um, uh, I have code, okay. Uh, I was making the slides. Uh, which one? Conditional. Did you see something? Comparison? Is it here? Oh, yeah, yeah it's, it's here, it's here, it's here. I put it, when I make the slides, I put them together. So I'm, I put the code together with the previous video. So here, let's take a look at. Mm. OK, uh, this one I will comment. OK, uh, I will open in the browser. Here, OK, uh, we, ha we have to open the developer tool to see the result. OK. So take a look at this one. So Z greater than A, you are getting true. Okay. Glow greater than Glee, you are getting false because the third letter, the third letter, let me make it make it like this way. So we can okay. like this. Okay. Uh, The third letter, O is uh, gr uh, greater than E, so we say true, okay? And uh, the last one, the B and the E, and uh, we, we, here we're missing one, right? And uh, so we, we can see the E is greater than the empty, so we'll get a true, okay? So next one, this is a string comparator, okay? String. And the next one is if we want, if we compare between different types, because in previous, previous video uh, slide we all compare either both of them are number and this one is both of them are string but if we compare based on different types when comparing values of different types javascript converts the values to numbers let's take a look at some examples through the code okay i will comment these two okay you these two and we will see Take a look at this one. You will get a true and a true because a two, two is a string type, and the two it can convert into what number two. Okay, then number two is greater than one, so you will say true. And and the next one is what? Next one. This is zero one. Okay, it will also can be converted into string. Uh, it can this is string zero one can also be converted into a number one. Number one is equal to one, so you will say true. Here we are using two equal sign. There are something strange. Uh, here we have more example here. Okay. Okay, so true is a boolean. Boolean boolean true will become one. So one equals equals one. It will get a uh, uh, true. And false will treat it as zero. So zero equal equal zero, you get a true. So let's see here. We will see two true true. Okay, I'll comment this two. Okay, you will see two true true. 
and two two. And the next one. Uh, next one. Uh, next one. I will give you uh this one. Okay, this one I don't want to explain here because it's related to next topic. Next one is like this one. Uh, next one is let me show you the one we give to a B. Okay, greater than one. So now. When I have a two a b greater than one, the result you will see is false. Okay. Now I will using what? Console log two a b smaller than one. Smaller than one, you will still see false. And now I will using what? Two a b equal equal one. Okay. Equal equal one, you will still see false. So in this case, we know 2AB will never become, uh, when we compare 2AB with 1, you will always get a force, no matter greater or less or equal. The reason is because what? The reason the reason is because 2AB uh, two here, 2AB is string, right? And when we do string, we first do a, when we do compare, you will try to con, uh, convert it into a number, right? So you will have this one, like a 2AB number, 2AB here. And as we know, 2AB is a string, and this string con contains the letters. It cannot, con it cannot do what? It cannot convert into a number. So you will get an NAN, okay? NAN is a special. numeric value the type of an n is a number and whenever you compare anything with n and you will get a force okay here i have examples see here i'm trying to compare an n with zero you will all get a force Okay, that's uh, the two a b greater than one. If you give uh, a zero or two, it doesn't matter. Okay, four. You will get all fours. And uh, here we have something uh, also special. When we get a con uh, con uh, undefined, when we compare undefined with zero, you will all get a force. Let me comment this too. Okay. Okay, you will get it also force. Okay, so that's a thing you have to be aware when we do com uh, comparison. Okay, especially for NN. Uh, that's it for this video and uh, for the strict uh, strict equality, which is this one. We will, I will cover in next video. Okay, so thank you for watching and I'll see you next time. Bye bye.